part of our 2022 North Dakota Optimist Volleyball Series player profile. And joining us now from the capital city, from Bismarck Century, that is Delaney Clark. And uh, Delaney, for you specifically here during your senior season uh, to get nominated and have a chance to, you know, go one more time uh, in the state of North Dakota at the high school representing the Bismarck Century Patriots. What does it mean to you here to be part of the Optimist Volleyball Series? You know, it's really just an honor to be nominated. I mean, for me, it's just kind of a reflection of all the hard work and dedication and commitment I've put into volleyball over the years. And it's just um, great to be able to represent like my team, my program. You know, the one thing, Bismarck Century, uh, they've been the Goliath on the block for some time in Class A volleyball in the state. What is it in the water, Delaney? Can you give us a secret recipe that makes a Century volleyball just so consistent year in and year out? Yeah, honestly, it's just the commitment the girls put into the program and then just bringing your best attitude and best work ethic every day to practice. Is there a particular memory that stands out maybe more than others during your time at uh, Century? Um, well, my favorite memory um, is just winning state volleyball my senior year. I mean, it was just to, nice to go out on a high note my senior year and just play with all those girls that I've been playing with for so long and go out on a high note. You know, in an Optimist series like this, it brings everybody together from across the state of North Dakota. So when you're kind of looking at your team, is there a particular player or two that you're excited to have actually setting you up or going to go get a dig or you don't have to worry about them spiking it across the net? Anything of that nature, Delaney? Um, well, Macy Friggin, she's one of my teammates. She's playing on the other team, but um, we're actually going to be rivals in college. So I mean, no time like the present to start now. Um, on my team is Mia Hens, I'm pretty sure. And she's from Bismarck High. And so kind of a crosstown rival there. And it's just going to be nice to play with her because I kind of grew up playing with her and doing some private lessons with her as well. So it'd be nice for, it to her, for her to be on my team. You mentioned about uh, college and rivals. So let's just take the next step. Uh, August, September, where are you going to be heading, uh, Delaney? And what's the next step in your future? Um, I'm going to Valley City State University and I'm playing volleyball there. So VCSU, obviously the North Star, you're going to mention about volleyball, but what was the right a decision for you, both from a volleyball standpoint, but also from an academic standpoint to go to VCSU Delaney? Yeah, so it's a bit of a smaller school. So I really liked that, like socially and academically, it was nice to have more of a good teacher to student ratio. And then of course, like the volleyball aspect, like it was a great fit for me, just not too far from home. And it was a great program. For you, if you could go back to your 14, 15 year old self or tell someone who's 14, 15 years old going, hey, I want to have an opportunity to play at the varsity level at some time in volleyball and maybe be an all stater or get nominated to a series like this. Uh, what would be some words of wisdom that you would pass down to them, Delaney? You know, I just tell them to just cherish every moment like those four years in high school goes by really fast and you just want to have fun and enjoy it and embrace the bad days because even when you're struggling one day you're going to miss it when it's over so final thing for you Delaney before we let you go superstitious are you super 